Happy Sunday, fellow thrifters, pickers, treasure seekers, whatever group. Uh, and if you saw my last video from this morning, uh, I went to the swan meet early this morning. I tend to do that every Sunday. Do garage sales on Saturday and thrift and retail during the week when I'm not shooting photos of babies. But uh, here, as promised, is my haul video from today. Actually, it's from three or really four stops. Um, we'll start off with backwards. I went to back to the rummage sale that I went to yesterday and got the only books that I got today. Right here is a got this little book of the art of war from the 60s. Thought I eBay that. For those who don't know me, I do a lot of Amazon FBA. I'm really conservative. If it doesn't have a barcode or shrink wrap from plastic, I hesitant to uh, buy it. I'm trying to get out of that zone and uh, buy a few more things I can put on eBay. That goes with uh, I found a stack of these books. Uh, Valentine's Illustrated History of World War II. And a uh, whole stack of them about, uh, I'd say, I'm not going to count, but maybe 10 or so. And the Roman Samuel was just trying to get rid of stuff that maybe in the last day, so it was a buck a bag. So I got them all for a buck including this and uh, then I'll try to bundle those up for eBay and uh, except for the Art of War I'll probably do that on its own and see how that goes also that rummage sale they have this still sealed new in box I guess from Costco it's a Wii family pack haven't done any research on it really except for I scanned it and it sells uh, for 20 bucks uh, 20 bucks on Amazon FBA. I think there's only like one other seller. A bunch of Wii controls, so I'm going to send that up to Amazon. And then uh, I hit a garage sale on the way back home and grabbed these uh, full 12 pack of Einstein uh, baby DVDs. Picked up three Wii titles a Hello Kitty. Kid Bop, and this cool one of Elmo that came with an El uh, Elmo Wii remote wrap. Got all all three video games and the uh, Baby Einsteins for 20 bucks, and this alone sells for 100 bucks on Amazon FBA in good condition. So score there, and then these games sell for I want to say. I'd say between 10 and 15 bucks a piece on Amazon. So those are going FBA. Oh, I also got this at the rummage sale. Um, I remember in my last video, haul video, I showed you the Christmas Ravensburger puzzles that were going for $15.80. This one scan did not come in. And it was an open box, but it's in great condition. So I figure uh, me and the family are going to have fun uh, putting it together and make sure all the pieces are there. And then I'll eBay or Amazon it have a site. It has a cut here on the box, but it's still the box is still in nice good condition. So let's go to the swap meat founds. Let's start over here. These are down kitty. These are uh, program modules for uh, irrigations. Um, funny story is I found these at a garage sale three weeks ago and I bought five from them a buck a piece and I've been selling them Amazon FBA because they're sealed Amazon FBA for ten bucks a piece and I've sold four of those five and then I found these at the swap meet turns out the same uh, couple was trying to get rid of the rest of their stuff at the swap meet today so I bought the rest for three bucks and I'll send those off to Amazon um, got this new sealed Latin party dance off and this apples to apples game for a buck a piece from a lady who was just sorts of the when I was heading out the door from the swamp she just wanted to get out of there she was originally asking for five bucks a piece when I first went in and so on the way out so it doesn't hurt to go back and try to haggle and get some things that you saw found this if you, some of you remember laser disc players set it here and zoom out 
I was heavily into laser discs. They came out before DVDs. They're like a giant DVD on growth hormones. But this is brand new, sealed. And I was kind of surprised to find it. It was on Amazon, FBA. One seller for a hundred bucks. And uh, I picked it up for three bucks. So I hope that sells pretty well there. And uh, let's see. Picked up this for a buck. Uh, wireless note notebook adapter. Still wrapped. Sorry, I can't sell it in Canada. It's kind of fuzzy there. I don't want to not focus. This is, you may have saw my other video while I was at the Swami. This is the first thing I saw when I came in at a booth. Um, DC Universe online game. Collector's Edition Batman figure. New factory sealed. Comes with poster and uh, comic book. Legends Zimmer Zero. Some other stuff here. Exclusive for the games. He wanted 25. I offered 20 and he took it. Funny thing is, when I started to walk away with it, he goes, Don't forget the game that comes with it. And he handed me this PS3 DC uh, Universe Legends game. Uh, factory sealed. And when I scanned the Batman figure in, didn't mention anything about a P PS3 game. I thought I was only getting that for 20 bucks. And by the way, this was uh, FBA was going for 125. So score 20 bucks, selling for 125. And when I got home, I scanned this in by itself. There was still no mention of this, including a game. But uh, this by itself is selling for 20 bucks. So 145 bucks for 20 bucks. I call that a win-win. Um, uh, let's go back over here. I'm starting to get into clothing, seeing some other videos about clothing. And uh, this is a Polo Ralph Lauren, extra large, picked up for a buck at a thrift store. This is a thrift store. Maybe I got it Friday at a rummage sale. And then I got a Calvin Klein sweater, extra fine and merino. And ever I'm not into fashion, but it's an extra extra large, nice sweater again for a buck. So I'll get this those listed on eBay. Starting to slowly get into clothing. Funny thing is, I actually found some uh, Tommy Bahama shirts for the first time at uh, Salvation Army yesterday, selling at a good price, 50% off but uh, they have stains on them. I might go back and get them and try to get the stains out. Last, um, I picked these up, these things up here at uh, my local uh, liquidator store I go to often. I used to get a lot of grocery stuff, but they've been stingy on the prices lately. But they had these, they had a bunch of things. I picked up uh, 10, gave one to my daughter, Camelback, brand new water bottles. Um, taking a chance on these, Got them for two bucks a piece. They are on Amazon with no sellers and no rank. Um, check the camel back. Uh, camel, camel, camel. And last price was about thirteen dollars. A different variation was selling on eBay for the same price, thirteen bucks. They even had one sold for twenty. So I'm gonna put a couple on eBay and I'll send a couple into Amazon FBA and see. How they do the pro the bad thing about it is uh if they do well they have plenty more i could have got but i don't want to go deep on them not knowing if they're going to go do well so we'll see how it happens i'll go if they sell well i'll go back and see if they have more but they'll probably be out by then it's it's a liquidation store next to me i actually go there and get my cereal and uh my perrier from there because it's dirt cheap but that's it. That's my haul for Sunday, June uh, 8th. So, um, probably see you next weekend. I'll probably be hitting thrift stores tomorrow. And then I have a couple of photo sessions I have to do during the week. So it'll be light. And I have been uh, scaling back on retail. Just because I haven't been finding much. And been kind of getting discouraged in retail. But that's it for today. And I'll probably see you next weekend. Or maybe have some how-to videos coming up this week.